hi all in this video i will be showing how we can schedule exam in microsoft azure for example like az 900 dp 900 or any az 204 for any exam how to schedule first uh, in the chrome type like a dp 900 so for example i am showing for dp 900 and you can type anything any like any exam you want just type dp 900 click enter okay here uh, you will get microsoft portal just click on it so once you open microsoft portal like we will be redirected into the uh, this is a, uh, also it's a learning path and also we can schedule our exam here so this azure data fundamentals exam dp 900 go below scroll down uh, here we can take the practice also practice of dp 900 and we can also experience demo also this is a launch based like a sandbox uh, for uh, like a certain period of time we will get uh, not all the uh, like uh, resources some there are specified resources we can do our hands on then scroll down below see here we will get two options schedule through pearson vue and schedule through uh certi port if you are uh, like if you are a student or a educator so here choose uh, this one peers and vue and click on schedule exam so next we will be redirected to this page and here provide all the like details like provide um, address uh, mob <coughs> mobile number and email everything and after we have to click on next in the next portal after clicking on submit we are directed redirected into this portal uh, here in, in we will be asking uh, like um, we are given some options uh, where do you want to take our exam uh, this one like in person at a test center uh, and uh, this one vuv online with vuv it's uh, test center means uh, there will be a center in the major cities uh, so we can choose that one uh, and also we can uh, schedule like take our exam from our home or wherever we can uh, you just we need our laptop and uh, there should be uh, like a uh, uh, the environment should be somewhat quiet because uh, it will be like a camera protected exam right so someone will uh, monitor from microsoft end or some third party end so here i will choose one uv online with vuv so, okay after that so here we have to make sure like we have a computer and testing space the actually the room should be distraction free uh, like a private place so it should be some there will not be any distraction so that uh, the test should can be handled smoothly and also we we should be ready with our any of the like a photo id i in i can uh, suggest like you can uh, ready with other or uh, pan card in india we will be uh, we can show uh, during the like uh, initial beginning of the exam and yeah, only these things we make to sure this not now because when by the time of our exam okay so here choose person vuv so i recommend uh, like indian people to take exam at the like um, a late night around like 11 pm or after that because there uh, there will be less distraction right so it will be easy for because in sometimes what will happen when like for example if there are distraction then uh, the some person from other side of the uh, like exam examiner will be there right they will ask some question why there is uh, more sound like that so it's better to take exam so next click on next so he will be directed to next and what is your preferred language for exam i will choose english you can have preferred languages too you can also choose your preferred languages next click again next okay and here uh, it's asking have you read and agreed microsoft uh, non-disclosure click yes by clicking on yes you acknowledge that you have read the agreement and while writing him you can read the agreement but since i have already read so just click on yes by clicking on yes you are acknowledge that you have read both agreements and any violation of the agreement can result in exam revocation or being banned from the microsoft credential okay so i think uh, let me open and i will show this one as well maybe this is showing like micro uh, any malpractice or not allowed like that maybe yeah. If you do any such thing then there will be chance that uh, we will not be <coughs> we will not be allowed to take any further exam from the microsoft and so click on yes okay next click on next again next uh, here again we have to go through all these things okay 
so we can read this one as well but uh, just check this check all the points this one third party limited license uh, check all the boxes okay next click on agree so we will be redirected again uh, what language would you prefer proctor to speak proctor means uh, as i said right there will be some person who will be monitoring our uh, like uh, exam so we want to choose which language they should be speaking so choose english as well here as well so click next and uh, again confirm your preferred time zone see in my case it's asia like kolkata means i am in same in india so choose that one if you are in some other country choose uh, preferred or um, time zone that is <coughs> belongs to that country just click yes that's right <laughs> next here we have to select the date and he select the date which we will be available and it is uh, good to take exam yeah. so we choose uh, like a suitable time for you and after choosing uh, time and date just click on book this appointment okay okay after choosing the <coughs> okay after after choosing the uh, like a uh, time you will be next redirected into the this uh, payment section uh, this uh, it will show price like it is in your indian rupees 3691 rupees for dp 900 exam and as per the like a uh, different different uh, certification uh, amount will vary and uh, also uh, here uh, also we can do one thing for example uh, that again i will show uh, how we can uh, <coughs> do that for example if you are working in some organization like uh, uh, some of the company like ibm or tcs and some other companies they will provide voucher for uh, their employees to redeem uh, certificate that also we can do that i will show now how we can do that one as well and after clicking on checkout right uh, after clicking on checkout we will be <laughs> redirected into enter payment and billing mode here if we have any voucher code right here we can enter that voucher code and we can redeem our voucher code uh, some as i said like some organization will provide 100 percent 50 percent voucher so based on that